We are working to bring you Culture Hack East, which is the first ever hackathon on culture to happen here in the East region. For those of you who don't know, Creative Front is a membership network for everybody working within the cultural and creative um, industries within Cambridgeshire. And we are working with the Arts Council England to bring this event uh, to you. Last year we ran a kickoff event uh, which was specifically for arts and cultural organisations to look at the opportunities around uh, data and your assets and working with technologists to kind of bring that to life. If you could do anything with digital within your organisation, what would you do? I'm Katie Beale, I'm a director at CAPER and we run the Culture Hack programme across the UK uh, and we're helping Creative Front produce it in the east of England. For me, Culture Hack is really important as um, a bridge between arts and technology and the creative industries. It really fosters uh, innovation, it allows for fast experiment, experimental prototyping with arts data that's never been released before. It also allows people to come together in a room and think up ideas and network and forge relationships that will then go on to develop other projects in the future. It also brings the topic up of open data and what that means and allows people to discuss that and think about what it means in the context of their organisation. I'm Georgia Ward, I'm the Digital and Creative Economy Relationship Manager for Arts Council England East and I am part of the board for um, Culture Hack East which is um, led by Anglia Ruskin University and um, CAPER. Arts Council has a 10 year strategy which is called Achieving Great Art for Everyone. Um, there are five goals and one of the key goals um, is about increasing distribution of art to basically get more people engaged and participating in the arts and the best way to do that obviously is through digital means or one of the ways of doing it is through digital means. From doing today's day to day what really came out for me was the participants have so much amazing information, assets and stories from their organisations and how if we can just help them release some of those stories and, and get them out into the general public where people can play with them and explore them then I would be really, really happy. Yeah.